Okay. Yeah. Yod. Yes. Welcome to Pop Tales. Thank you. You're back on this side. I am. And you are back on this side because this is the season finale of Pop Tales. It is. It is. It is the season finale of Pop Tales of season... Is this officially season two? I guess, end of season two? I guess, yeah, it's the end of season two. It was a long season. <laughs> it was a long first season. <laughs> Hit my music. <laughs> Right, so, I wanted to do a simple cocktail for this episode. Yeah. Um, tasty, obviously, but simple. Yes. Um, because I wanted to incorporate some stuff that, like, like it symbolizes the, the entire season and, like, our year going forward. Yeah. So, new with the old stuff. Yeah. yeah. Because, obviously, there was a reason this is the season finale. Yeah. And it's so we can do, do other stuff. Yeah. Still real talk related, just different, different shows and different avenues we're exploring, and that's what the whole sort of lead up to this episode has been. Yeah. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a classic fits okay. with you today. Oh, thank you. It would be a bit exciting because, you know, you, you put behind the camera for 25 episodes, you might as well be here. Yeah. Um, so, obviously, one last time. Sponsor me, please. You're gonna have to at this point, because we're badgering you too. When Maybe. we bring when we bring Poptails back, yeah, you better be sponsoring me, <laughs> Greg. I don't think what is his name. <laughs> he looks like Greg. Uh, do me a solid. Choice. Chuck two shots of gin. Oh, that. right. I thought you were gonna say put two ice cubes in it. Season two of Poptails. What was yep. your favorite episode? Favorite drink so far. Favorite drink so far. I can tell you that mine has occurred in the last eight episodes. I mean... Meaning today. <laughs> uh, I don't know, that's a hard one because I really do like all of the episodes that we've done. But if I have to pick one because I'm a whiskey lover, I would have to pick probably one of the old-fashioned drinks. Probably, I want to say Zuko. Yeah? Yeah, I want to say Zuko. Chuck a shot of that in there for me. Uh, yeah, Zuko's old fashioned. Yeah, f off! <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> yeah, Zuko's old fashioned. That was probably one of my favorite ones, mainly because, you know, I'm a whiskey drinker. I love it. Oh and no, I, I'm on your, I'm 100% on your side because mine was Iro. Iro? Yeah, I really liked I that did... spicy bitch. Yeah. Uh, Took a half of that in there? Sure. I really do like the tea. The, um, the tea serum. I enjoyed the tea serum because. Which is ironic, really, because I've made a lot of shit that I've spent like hours on, and it's come out, and I've been like, yeah, this is alright. And that took me like 30 seconds. Yeah. And it was delicious. So, would you say that's your favorite cocktail we've done so far? Like, total? Or. I wouldn't say favorite one so far, because we did do a lot of really good ones in season one, which I will. That's, we will post a link to all the other episodes that we've done. There's a playlist. We, like... we, yeah, we've made a playlist. No. Yeah? Oh. Somewhere like the last 30 seconds of the show. Yeah, um, but yeah, we've done so many good ones, and it's really hard to pick because, like, obviously, because like, we're Star Wars fans, we've done Star Wars drinks. I I've know, just, by the way, I've just, I've just picked like six medium to large mint leaves. Yep. Okay. Give them a slap. Yep. Release the oils. Yep. Give them a roll. Yep. Um, yep. Drop them in the shaker. Nice. Okay, that was it. Karen. Oh, okay. <laughs> Chuck some ice in here. Yep. But yeah, we've, we've done a lot of really good, really tasty drinks. Um, I mean, what, what was one of yours? What, total? Uh, upon revisiting them, because I have been compiling all of the old recipes, because they were scattered everywhere, Yeah. Um, I've been compiling them into one solid book, yeah. which I'm kind of excited about. Yeah. Uh, subject to release, if I can never get anyone to pick or get enough recipes in there. Yeah. Um, end draft. End draft. After going through all of them, I, I remembered rewriting the recipe for end draft and just going, oh, shit, man. End that draft, sounds really fucking nice. End draft was a really yeah, cool I'm just going to shake this for like 15 to 20 seconds. Carry on. Yeah. Good. Am I still talking? Yeah. Yeah. How you doing? <laughs> Tall glass. Yes. But you know what, the season that we've just done 
and that all of you lovely little fuckers have watched. It was a really good season. It was a really good season. I thoroughly enjoyed making it. Mainly because... Fuck, this is delicious. Rick's Portal Gun. Rick's Portal Gun. Rick's Portal Gun was making. good. The, do you know what? If, if, if you count season two as ending before we took the two weeks off to explain to everyone what was happening over the next... 12 months, yeah. and season 3 just being the last 8 episodes, yeah. the Shibatsuki. The Shibatsuki. I fucking love that. Do you know, the drink itself may not be the best one I've made. It's a good drink, don't get me wrong. Yeah. Um, I've made a lot of drinks in my time. Um, but that is by far one of the most, the most fun I've had yeah. for a really long time. The Shibatsuki was a really good episode and it was a really good drink. Such a good drink. So this is a fizz. Now a classic fizz is literally just... Gin, mint, and lime. Yeah. And then you top it up with tonic water, which I'm about to do with this. Nice. Fever tree bottle. Um, and it's really, there's one, I don't know if it's actually, by the time this episode is out, it will definitely be on the menu. A DJ is called the Archie Fizz, where the focus of that drink is the gin. Okay. Which is our the Archie Rose signature gin. Yeah. Um, which obviously we get from Archie Rose, which is just around the corner from us, really. Yeah. Um, so this is a small mouth fizz. Because Smallmouth is the center of our beverage. Yes, and they're sponsoring us. They are sponsoring us. This is a nice, easy, delicious beverage that I knew was going to come out well. It highlighted the Smallmouth, which has really been the highlight of this season. Yeah. Last season. Since I found them, basically. Yeah. Um, and it's just been a, you know, we just wanted to do a really nice episode where we could both come on here and talk about how much we appreciate the fans. And also to let you know that Poptails will be coming back. It will um, be. We don't know when it's going to be coming back. Like next week, uh, the first, well, the first episode's been out, but like we will be starting in our ongoing series, Little Sack Big Adventure. Yeah. Which is, like I was saying to you before we started this episode, it's ironic really because it is the next step in our real tour. Yes. We are moving on to some other stuff. We are going to do gameplay. Hopefully by now will have streamed a little bit. Yeah. Um, if not like a full regimented thing. There like we have said it before, we're constantly coming up with ideas. And back on the first of February we started our new routine with our editing and filming, which is when all of these episodes are being filmed. Mm -hmm. And it's just, you know, hopefully eight weeks in the future we are ahead and everything is good. Yeah. And you know It's the next step, it's the end of this season for the beginning of another show that you guys will love and we're going to have so much fun Look, doing. I can guarantee you this. Yeah. If Pop Tales isn't back by Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. there will be a Pop Tales episode on or the week of Thanksgiving. Okay. I promise that. All right. And I know what it's going to be. <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> now let's try this delicious beverage. You want to go first or me? Well, not at the same time. You want to do it at the same time? No, that's How is it? Yeah, it's delicious. Yeah? They're always delicious. Fizzes are tasty. There, there, was, there has never been a fizz I've not had. That is good. That is if you really don't good. have small mouth and you don't like the idea of putting edible glitter in, which is some resistance I have discovered whilst showing this to people, Yeah. because um, it's all about the gin, like that's the highlight. Yeah. Archie Rose or Roku Gin, top notch. Yeah, you want a very flavorful gin, something very botanical that's going to show, that's going to really shine through. Yeah. But um, you've learned stuff off me this year. I have learned stuff off you. I pick up stuff behind the camera. Yeah. <laughs> that's what you get for filming and editing all of my garbage. <laughs> there, there you go. That is a small mouth fizz. That is what will be happening going forward into the future. Thank you for supporting cocktails up to this point. Yeah. We will be back. We hope that you stay and also enjoy. Um, the gameplays that are coming forward and our new um, universe like, movie pitch show mm -hmm. that is coming out after that um, and it's just been an absolute pleasure we are knuckling down we are working hard we are outgrowing ourselves yes so for the, the last time for a while keep it real stay sexy drink safe bye bye, bye. we love you this.